Welcome to Rick Stone's Fish and Chips. Josh, I've got a chippy tea, which was 9 95 and that's cotton chips with some mushy peas. And Caroline got the same as me, cake and chips and mushy peas. That's curry. That hay looks nice. Curry sauce. All cooked in beef dripping. That's a curry sauce. Nice. What are your chips like? Mm. Crispy. Crispy Crispy, peas. crispy batter now. Nice peas. consistency. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, they're good. Nice natural colour, not bright green. Crispy. Oh, look at that crispy oh, batter. Oh. This is the hake. Look how thick that is. And juicy. Absolutely tremendous. Oh. Mm. Crispy batter. Chips are crispy. Crispy on the outside. Fluffy in the middle. Mm. Mm. Crew sauce. Which is actually quite spicy. Mm. And a little bit watery, isn't it? Yeah, I think that the only thing is if the consistency is not right. It's um just a touch too runny for me. It needs to be thicker. But oh, it tastes nice. And it one pound seventy five. It's tiny, it's just a little pot. So but if you think it'll be more natural though, than not than the, not adding the thickness to it. Yeah. Will they? I just that's the only negative, isn't it? The cost of that and the consistency. But it's more homemade than yeah. the traditional fish and chips. The fish is absolutely outstanding. Yeah. Beautiful, fresh, mm. moist, crispy batter, and the chips are absolutely delicious, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Absolutely gorgeous chips. Yeah, it's expensive, but you know it's Rick Stein, isn't it? You're paying, you're paying for that premium. I think the whole thing comes to about thirty nine pound. So it's a one off in Padsto. Thought I'd try them, and uh, yeah, I highly recommend it. Would you like some peas? I'm gonna try some mushy peas, yeah. Yeah, mushy peas. These are alright these. £1.75 and you only get a tiny little pot. But yeah, they are good, aren't they? Yeah. These yeah. like proper traditional mushy peas, good consistency, good colour. 
Yeah. They are good. I think they're really good actually. <laughs> they're very nice. Mm. Just a curry sauce for me. The rest of it's absolutely as you would expect. Mm. I think I prefer hake. Mm. It's really nice. Thick and juicy. There is some skin on it though, so if you don't like skin. I've not got skin. Maybe they could remove it for you if you ask them. But there's no skin on there. You like had it. You no. sometimes get skin no. on there. Shall well, me. The thickness of that. Oh, just open it up. It is beautiful. Well, there's no skin on the cod. No skin on the cod. It's usually haddock, isn't it? And hake. Yeah. So, Rick Stein fish and chips in Padstow. What we think? Nine Amazing. out of ten? Ten out of ten. I'll keep nine, just because of the nine. curry sauce. But yeah, well worth it. And we're also washing it down with Chalky's Bite, which is a Rick Stein beer. It's that one there. You can get it. Actually, in the fish and chip shop or his deli next door. Very strong though, isn't it? Mm. It's good though. About 6.8%. Uh... Oh, yeah, that's nice. They used to say it had like a taste of fennel, didn't mm. they? But you don't say that. As well now. with fish and chips. So, yeah, frim pad store. And you're not on a tight budget. Or you want to treat yourself. I'd recommend it. Until next time, thanks for watching. Mm.